Next item would be the superintendent's report. Yes, and just continuing on the theme of dates, I'll just go back for a second and say that the, the senior prom was held on May 1st, and I understand, and Emma has confirmed as well, that it was a great success, and <laughs> off without any uh, incidents. I think the kids had a very enjoyable time. I don't know. Kate, do you have anything to add? It was beautiful. <laughs> Uh, the just to let you know in terms of other upcoming performances May 28th 29th and 30th the Lamplighters Hamlet production in the Wilmington High School Auditorium at 7 o'clock p.m. on June 4th is the stem fair and that's in the Wilmington Middle School cafeteria at 6 p.m. we mentioned scholarship night on Friday June 5th at 6 30 p.m. in the high school auditorium graduation June 7th Sunday, June 7th at 2 o'clock p.m. in the Wilmington High School Gymnasium. And we also mentioned the Underclassmen Award Ceremony, June 11th, Wilmington High School Auditorium at 6.30 p.m. Also wanted to let you know that uh, WCTV currently is broadcasting a video of the Analog Tech Fair several times a week. The web broadcast can be found by going to vimeo.com, which is where they post their videos, searching for Wilmington Science Fair 2015. There's a lot of great uh, kid shots and great interview with two seventh grade students near the end of the video, near the end of the video, and uh, most of the volunteers and there are also school committees, school committee members featured in the video as well. So, take that. In. Yeah, I hope it's no one I know. <laughs> <laughs> And lastly, I just wanted to mention that two members of our district leadership team uh, had new additions to their family over the last several days. Uh, Jen White had her baby boy on May 4th, early in the morning, and Erin Burke, the assistant principal at Shawsheen, had her baby boy as well uh, on, um, I think it was actually earlier today? I think so. Yeah, I think it was actually uh, uh, right <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yep. Uh, and uh, Jen and her husband are still working on name selection, and Aaron's son's name is Jack Joseph Burke. Oh, nice. Everybody's nice. healthy and Excellent. happy. And that concludes my report. Very nice. Thank you. Um, let me see. Old business. Um, there is no old business. New business, um, we did the reorganization right at the beginning, so we have the personnel report. And I uh, will ask Paul if he can give us that report. Thank you. Uh, in front of you, we have a personnel report as of April 28th. Uh, we had one uh, teacher resign effective March 13th, and she has been replaced. Uh, Jessica Feist um, is the teacher that's leaving, and Erin Gibson uh, was her replacement. Yeah. Anyone have any questions about? I think that's good. It was a small report <laughs> this time of the year. Okay, and the revolving account report. Again, I would turn that over to Mr. Ruggiero. Thank you. Um, in front of you, you have the um, revolving report as of April 27th. Um, it's not too much different than the last time I did it, which was a early March, I think. Um, you will see there's a few or a couple of um, looks like negative balances, but again, um, revenues have been posted through the end of January where the expenses are uh, current as of April 27th. That will all be caught up as the town works to reconcile bank statements and post the revenue. So I don't see any issues with us in the year in the black and every revolving account. Does anyone have any questions about this? Oh, great. Okay. Um, public comment. We have reached public comment already. <laughs> no, no public comment. Uh, let's move on to other reports. Do we have any other reports? What I'd like to do, though, um, could we look at the list of um,
Um, I just wanted to go over this, the subcommittees to see if anybody felt like they wanted to um, make a change or were unable to continue or wanted to add something. So if we can look down, the policy subcommittee is um, Mrs. Burns, Mrs. Bonish, Mr. Bjork, and Mrs. Carroll as an alternate. Oh, do we like uh, that? Should we wait for Manny to be doing this, just in case he want to switch, or is it okay if we do this? I think we'll definitely switch him if he wants to, but I think that, oh, okay. um, yeah, right. no, definitely I'll ask him what he, what he wants okay. to do. Yeah. I think that, um, let's do the ones we can do, and then um, I'll, I'll see if there's something he wants to change or not. We'll change him. Okay. He and I do the sick bank subcommittee. That's worked out well. I think he might want to stay on that, but I'll check. And um, superintendent evaluation subcommittee would be Mrs. Broussard, myself, and Mr. Bjork. Okay. The technology task force. Were we going to think about that for this? Yeah, yeah. No, I think the technology task force may be, uh, may become a district-wide technology committee that would be um, staffed, if you will, by uh, teacher representatives from all the various buildings and departments so we get a cross-functional team and it would be a sort of an internal superintendent's advisory committee. Okay. Does anybody have any comments year. on that? Do they have to feel that's acceptable? Will one of us be able to represent that or no, it would just be in-house? Yeah. It would be the um, the school system, and when they're ready to bring, if there's going to be a change in policy or um, change in policy or some or any budgetary impact, budgetary impact, then okay. they bring it to us. But otherwise, we wouldn't. Okay, so we'll have um, Amanda take this one off. Okay. Oh, um, the school committee representative to Wilmington Educational Foundation Board of Directors. Mrs. Carroll and Mrs. Broussard, we're happy there. Yeah. Yeah. Does anyone else? All right. Okay. Else school committee rep to the School Wellness Advisory Committee. I'll keep that. Yeah. Okay. And school committee rep to the CPAC. Is anyone else interested? In I really enjoy going to those. I keep those. Do you, do you want a second person, Mark, uh, Peggy? Oh, and. Um, I'm not sure that we know. Would you like to do that? If you'd like a second person, I can do that. I'm trying to think if, we're, hmm, if we want a second person or we want. We could rotate it. You mean, can just, just do you it. You want me to be an alternate? Yeah, I like you. Yeah. Okay. If one can't go, the other one goes. Oh, that would be great. Okay. Okay. I think two of us, because it's only a board of about six, mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. two of us might be overwhelming, <laughs> but um, do you think? I think so. Um, but that would be great, alternate because sometimes I haven't been able to make it. Um, and they're going to be coming to speak to us at a later meeting in the year. To, you'll be pleased with so much progress they make. They're, they're a very good group. Um, I'm do, I do the executive session minutes, and I've done them twice now, and they're just, whether they should be for release, and they aren't for release at this point. They're still not for release. So I would continue to do that. Um, the school building committee, I'm not sure how long we're going to keep that, how long that keeps going, but as long as it keeps going. Yeah, I think, I mean, the project is going to be completed in October, so I imagine there will be a handful more meetings just to take us through the final phases. Um, I believe the town manager's intent is to actually transition back to the permanent building committee um, for purposes of, of overseeing the facility master study, whatever they're calling it. Uh, so I'm sure he'll get back to us in terms of representation, if, if, if however that's laid out by by law or charter in the town. All right. Okay, that's good. And then we can see about that. Excellent. And um, I'll, let me see. A legislative representative. I'd please. like to still do it. If I was just going to say, please right. don't tell us that you're not going to do <laughs> it. <laughs> my hands, my so hands in the thick of things right now. So yes, and, absolutely. And things are starting to heat up with the park aspects so I'm gonna get on it is excellent thank okay. you thank That's you great MJ appreciate it and um, the handbook protocols 
Mrs. Burns, Mrs. Kane, and I don't know, Julie's yeah, name is not on there. I should be on there. Yeah, yeah there we'll go. add Julie's name. We're practically almost done. Almost. That should be coming soon. Yeah. Almost. Yeah, <laughs> so that'll be good. Our pieces are pretty much done. Oh, okay, when those you. are done, then we'll Thank meet you. again. That'd be great. Thank That's you very great. much. All right, and I don't think, if we ever thought of any other subcommittees that we needed, we'll just, we can just add them at times but um, so that's excellent okay um, oh one thing I would like to ask the um, the list okay yeah. <laughs> yeah, before we get to that though <laughs> okay um, before we get to that I just want to ask if um, maybe we could put together that list from now until the middle of June of the activities, the day, the night, for the school committee to have a list. Oh, of all the different of activities the, between that now was a long and... Sure, list. that would be great. Thank yes, yeah. absolutely. And yep. um, that would be great if Amanda could just email that to us. Mm -hmm. Does that sound? Yeah, I think we'd have to do that. Okay. And we have one more item of business. WC, we are going to redo the um, reorganization. No, she didn't. They just want to announce it. Announce it. Oh, just announce it. Oh, excuse me. Audio that. wasn't on. That's it. Oh, all right. Thank you. All right. I'll do that in a minute. Um, oh, we have administrative assistants who are um, ready to negotiate for their contract. So we'd like to see if um, two people would like to join that subcommittee for. Um, Contract negotiations for administrative assistance. I did it last year, so I can do it. Yeah, do you like to? Oh, good. Catherine, great. I think it's a long contract. I can do it. I'm a lifetime member of their union, so I can't. I can't do it. So, do we have a second? Sure. I'll do it. Okay. Thank you, Steve. All right. So um, that'll be great, Mrs. Carroll and Mr. Bjork. So we'll be reaching out to you shortly with for dates to plan dates for our first meeting. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Very good. Okay, we just want to announce them. Yes, I think so. Oh, okay. Um, I'll recap. Um, we had um, our reorganization right at the beginning, and um, I have been reelected as chairperson. Mrs. Bonish, vice chairperson. Mrs. Broussard as um, secretary. Okay, so thank you very much to everybody. And if this is a sample of our meetings that are going to come, you'll be glad you <laughs> voted for us. <laughs> Everything was good. Okay, could I entertain a motion to adjourn? Mrs. Burns. I make a motion to adjourn. Do we have a second? Mrs. Carroll. All those in favor? Unanimous, please, Kim. Thank you, everybody.